watch out. Watching out for your medical interests. Later in the program, has your DNA been sampled without your consent? But right now, we have a strange tale to tell. This is David's story. The story of a man who woke up one morning to discover... Hello, I'm PC David and this is my story. One morning I woke up to find that my arm had fallen off and it lay in the bed. I was a bit short of time that day so I decided to go to work as normal. Well, almost normal, as normal as can be expected in these circumstances. When I returned that evening I found that the arm had grown into an identical twin of me. A clone. Who the hell are you? I'm PC David. No, I'm PC David. Oh, uh, I'm your clone then. My clone? Yeah, uh, your clone. I, I grew myself asexually from your arm. Do you remember you left it this morning? Left it this morning? I didn't mean to leave it this morning. It just fell off. Well, very useful it has been for me too. Will I be getting my arm back? Uh, don't know, mate. If you if you can grow another one, yeah. Uh, but I'm using this one now. Well, we started to argue, and first I considered murder because I knew I couldn't be done for murdering my own clone. But then started to see the advantages. We could uh, do each other's shifts. He preferred nights anyway, and I liked days, so I could spend every night with the wife then. So the arm started to grow back, and everything's turned out all right. Bye then. Oh, give my regards to Doris at the office. Okay, oh, yeah. see ya. But David is not alone. We spoke to someone who's familiar with asexual reproduction. It came as a bit of a shock that I could reproduce asexually. Bits of my leaves fell off and they just grew into new versions of me. So is it possible? We spoke to Professor Schwarzwald Kirsch. Possible. One that cannot grow people asexually, you need to have the sex, once the fusion of the sperm and the egg. I think you have been playing with the film. However, we spoke to some sheep. They tried to make more of us. Clones, they called it. So that's PC David's story. But don't worry, it won't happen to you unless you're an armed police. Good, Good night. night. If your DNA has been affected by anything you've seen in this program, select the red button now for more information.